you know, the impact that he has had on the Monona Girls School District, I mean, is, is really immeasurable. Um, when we look at our core mission, right, of, of educating students, and he epitomizes that in his work, that everything that we do, the end result is how is this going to help our teachers teach kids in the classroom? He was always a pleasure to work with, and uh, he is a hard type of person to find in today's world, having that as Tim McGraw would say, that humble and kind atmosphere. The purpose of the School Business Manager of the Year Award is to recognize the recent outstanding contributions of the recipient to their local school district and community and to the business manager profession. Jared Rossing, Assistant Superintendent of Operations for the Middleton Cross Plains Area School District is being recognized for his active leadership in his district, community, region, and profession. Last year, he moved to Middleton after serving as the Director of Business Services for the Monona Grove School District for 12 years. In terms of service, Rossing has co-chaired WASPO's Fall Conference Planning Committee for years, has served as co-chair of WASPO's Madison Area Regional, serves as a mentor to new business managers, and actively makes significant contributions to his community. Some of the biggest accomplishments at Monona Grove include the completion of three phases of energy efficient projects, the approval of a $57 million facilities referendum, and three operational referendums, and the development of a new teacher retirement benefit that provides long-term fiscal sustainability. Congratulations to Jared Ross. He is a master at building relationships, and uh, by that meaning earning the trust, uh, which is so important, and respect of our staff, of our school board, of our community, of his colleagues. Um, that is really what allows us uh, to um, you know, provide the resources that we need you know, for our students. He was a quiet, professional contributor who never discounted anyone else's opinion. He had a great imagination and we relied on him heavily, especially in the area of team, team building because he had such a terrific imagination when it came to making things not only educational, but also a lot of fun. I'm so uh, thrilled that Jared uh, has received this award. It was so deserving and, uh, um, and it's been a real honor for me to uh, work with him. Being uh, named the School Business Manager of the Year is an extreme honor. Uh, receiving this award definitely represents all the hard work and dedication of my peers, coworkers, team members, and board members that I've been able to work with over the years. And, have, and what we've done for students. I would say it's definitely been a team approach. I can't say that I can take all the credit, but it's definitely an honor to be receiving this award. So I would like to start out by saying there are many people that have helped me along the way, and I'm extremely grateful to all of them. But I would like to start out by thanking my family specifically, my wife, Stephanie, and our four great and wonderful children, Keegan, Preston, Josette, and Kennedy. They have always been there for me and supported my crazy schedule and ideas. I would have to say, especially when it came to using them as students in a bus how-to video during COVID. In addition to my family, I've worked with some of the best staff, coworkers, and board members. Uh, my first superintendent, Don Houck, who took that chance on me as his bookkeeper and then encouraged me to get my 08 license. Tim Erickson for taking me to the next level by hiring me as his finance service manager. Craig Gerlach for giving me that first opportunity to be a lead as a director of business services with the Monona Grove School District, and Dan Olson for continuing my growth as a director with the Monona Grove School District. And then finally, Dana Minow for taking me to that next step of my career as the assistant superintendent of operations with the Middleton Cross Plains School District. But last but not least, all of you and my fellow coworkers and colleagues that serve our profession in the WASWO staff. This is a great organization to belong to. Our work is extremely hard, but always remember that we're here for the students. Don't feel like you need to know all the answers, but know where to go to get help. Ask questions, build relationships, keep smiling and laughing and have fun in the work you do. It's so rewarding.